What's going on everybody? It's Joel here and today we're doing another unboxing video. I know I've been a little bit on a tear with unboxing videos, but I promise you guys reviews are coming soon. It's just a little bit easier for me to do the unboxing videos. They require quite a bit less work from me. Uh, but this one is really cool. If you guys haven't been following me on Instagram, I guess I really haven't even been putting anything up about this, but I'm going to, uh, or I was invited to, the Under Armour Human Performance Summit in January. I'm going to be there from like the 13th to the 16th. Um, John from Obese the Beast was invited as well, as well as um, Under Armour athletes such as James Newberry. And I actually have no clue what's going to go on there. I know we're going to see new shoes and new technology and stuff, but otherwise, I mean... Human Performance Summit, I guess there's going to be something to do with working out. But anyways, Under Armour invited me out to that and they also sent out this official travel kit. So this is the box for it. It came in another box, uh, but I already opened that. So we're just going to unbox this one. Um, Under Armour is all around it. And then there is the Under Armour Human Performance uh, Summit. Oh crap! Oh, oh well. Uh, but yeah, that's it. So I've been holding off. Let's open it up and see what's inside the box. Uh, there's no tape or anything. No. Okay. Now you've got the gear you need to travel to Baltimore in January. So it is in Baltimore. I'm from California, and my cold is like. 50 degrees, it, that's freezing for me. So I know it's gonna be ridiculously cold when I get there. Um, let's see here. When you w make your trip, but don't want to try it out, suit up, connect, to map my run, to log miles or workouts and get going. Okay, uh, so that's like their little um, run app, which is actually pretty good. Um, I can vouch for that. It's got like uh, different run paths that people take. It's it's actually pretty cool. Uh, so let's see what's in the box. I'll just kind of hold it up so you guys can take a little peek. So we got a few things in here. Let's pull them out. Uh, nice little Under Armour, little thermos kind of thing. Yeah, that's not really opening. Am I doing this wrong? Anyways, I'm not going to open that up. So, insulated bottle, vacuum insulated bottle, 530 milliliters, 18 ounces. It is by Thermos. Cool. Um, I was actually scared that I said something wrong, but yeah, it's made by Thermos. Cool. Um, here's a, this is all kind of tied together. So, we've got all this tied together. Um, got a little Under Armour track jacket, athlete recovery jacket, cool, recovery jacket, it's pretty nice, material's nice, it's like a Therma kind of material I want to say, let's see, we've got Under Armour cooling socks, low cut, I actually do like Under Armour socks quite a bit. Oh wow. <laughs> There's a little uh, eye mask so that you can knock out. Uh, Purell sanitizing wipes. Presumably for the plane ride. Which is only about five hours, so it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, athlete recovery shirt. Powered by Celiant. That was like uh, their, I forget what it's called, uh, the last like heat gear thing that they released. Uh, nice feeling shirt. And then some athlete recovery pants. Um, yeah. Oh, these are large. Oh no, it's too big. Uh, we'll see, hopefully they fit me. Let me see. Under Armour, across the side. Oh, they're like breakaway, tearaway pants at the bottom. Only goes up to maybe like six inches. Those are nice. And then their new shoes, and I don't actually 
remember the name for these. Oh, I'm sure it's in one of these cards here. Let's see. Fly far, recover fast. Travel like a pro and UA recover. So we're supposed to wear this on the plane. Uh, it all starts with UA recover. It's mineral infused fabric. Helps give you more energy and reduce muscle fatigue. Pro tips, departure, wear UA recover gear and eye mask, wipe down your seat area, eat on your new time zone schedule, in flight hourly, get up, stretch, drink carbonated water, uh, after landing, seek natural light, go for a walk or light exercise, create your sleep sanctuary, get back to your sleep and rise routines. Cool. Uh, map my run stuff, my fitness pal. Um, and here we go. Here is, okay, so it's all the UA recover stuff. This is the little card. I'm not going to read the, the whole thing. And the shoes are called the UA Hover Machina. Um, these are not out yet. I'm not allowed to talk about the performance or anything uh, for them yet, but I can show them to you. So uh, it tells me to share my journey. This is it. The UA Hover Machina. These are new hover shoes. I'm not quite sure what the purpose of these shoes is, but they do have the compression web over the midsole and that was on the Project Rocks and I really like that implementation. These feel pretty sturdy, like the outsole midsole combination feels pretty sturdy and then you have like a like a knit upper. There's not really any stretch to it or anything, but it feels good. Let's take this little thing out here. Don't feel flexible. They feel more like training shoes than they do, than they would running shoes. There's a propulsion plate, so you have midfoot shank right at the bottom there, um, and that's supposed to give you more propulsion, keep you in motion a little bit better. Uh, other people do it. This is one of the first times, no, actually Under Armour does it quite a bit, but that's the first time I've seen this kind of implementation. Um, then there's a light heel counter, and that's just kind of like an overlay. Um, exposed hover midsole right at the bottom, and then full rubber uh, from the toe to the heel. Flex screws that don't really do too much because it's not super flexible. Uh, laces, pretty nice. Tongue, pretty nice. Not a lot to talk about the formats, but that's that's the, uh, I guess, build, I guess. I guess I'm not really allowed to talk about the stack height and the drop or anything, uh, so I'm not going to talk about that. And then this has Bluetooth connectivity. Uh, I probably said more than I should have, uh, but whatever. Uh, and then I get this little little human performance summit tag. Okay, that's it. Um, just an unboxing, going over some of the stuff that Under Armour sent me. Super cool. Uh, really appreciative that Under Armour's even bring me out to this thing. Uh, yeah, I, I'm not like an athlete or anything, but uh, it's cool that they, they reached out to me and gave me this opportunity. Bro. So sh big shout out to Under Armour. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, reviews are coming as soon as possible. Um, if you guys like this video, make sure you hit that like button. Uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel. And of course, thanks for watching, guys.